Hello everybody, it's Pokekid Anthony here. Okay, so, uh, first thing, I have gotten a haircut. Please don't say I look like Hitler, because I don't. At all. I am not going to ever have that mustache. It is disgusting. Anyway, today we are doing a Mega Steelix deck list. And, yeah, it's going to be epic. So, let's just crack on with it. Now, I know my lip looks weird, but that's because I keep eating it. So, anyway, let's go ahead and keep going with this deck list. Um, first, you need to know is the list itself. Let's get my camera like this. I'm, I'm sorry, I have low power camera this is just the basic rundown so yeah here's the deck list first we're running one carving seems weird but that is for decks like mega scissor which yesterday a little fun fact I beat a mega scissor deck because I had carving um, this deck used to have Carbink Break, but I just changed it to a Clawitzer. Anyway, speaking of Clawitzer, we have its pre-evolution Clawitzer, two of them. And then we got two Clawitzer. If you don't know, Clawitzer is the Howitzer Pokemon. Um, its ability is what we use it for. I don't, I'm not very good at this, um. There we go. Mm, trying to get to the howitzer guy. Ah, uh, there we go. And there's his ability. Mega boost. That helps. Steel looks up so much, but I'm not sure if you could have read read that, but I'm sorry about the camera, but anyway, we got three Steelix EX. These are what leads into the only proxies in this deck, three Mega Steelix. Their attack is Canyon Axe. What it is, is it deals 160 damage costs 5 energies, 1 steel, and 2 double colorless. And then, it's b good because it does 160 damage, and it's on a dual type Pokemon of fighting and steel. And because of Karen, Yon Mega's out. And now because of Karen being out, making everything bad, this is what's happening. Mega Gardevoir, Dark Rytina. Those are the big decks. This deck, Mega Steelix, is scared of Garatina, but it kills Gardevoir because you're giving it a weakness. Also, my mom's using Gardevoir. It is good, but not good enough to beat this because. Mom, my mom's deck uses Xerneas Break and Mega Gardevoir as the main attackers. It sets up turn two, but we stall them with Carbink. Um, instead of Carbink, you could use something else in theory. Not sure, but something else could work. Not sure, again. But anyway. Oh, I got some more pretty steel energies. Might want to replace my other steel energies. Anyway, um, then the usual stuff for the items. Let's see if I can grab them. Four VS Seekers, of course. Um, no oh crab. Four Special Charge, which is a new item that allows you to shuffle two special energies from your discard into your deck. That's amazing for this kind of deck. Um, we got 
two escape ropes, if I can hold them correctly. Mm hmm. We have four Ultra Balls. That's common knowledge to use. Three Super Odd. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why three? That's so many. Let's just say you're getting rid of your... You only run five basic energies. That's what's saving you from uh, Tina. So you're going to need those super rods. That and if they knock out your Clouters to stop you from setting up, they're pretty much screwed. Unless you can special charge them back or special charge the energies back and wait more turns. Or to super rod and wait turns to get Clouter back. Anyway. It's super helpful, trust me. Um, two Floatstone. That's just easy for the two Clowitzer. We could put one more in, in theory, just take out Giovanni. In fact, that's what I'd actually recommend. So, take out Giovanni Scheme for another Floatstone if you want. It's a great idea just for the carving. Um, anyway, 2N. Those are just easily in here. I wish I had a couple full art in. But those are $70 each. But anyway, 3 Steel Spirit. I'm sorry I skipped those, but those are what makes this deck a little faster. Just able to put that on and then go straight for that Candy Axe. And then we got. For Professor Sycamore. The reason why I say don't take any of those out, you're going to be digging a lot in this deck. Because you're, you're only running 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 basic Pokemon. You got to get those out. Um, one Lysander. Easy. One Hex. This Hex, Garboder only. Oh, wait, no, not go Garboder. I'm trying to think of something else. That's what it is. Tina only. If you are against Tina, you have to use this. Because Tina is stopping you from using your Mega Steelix. So you just gotta get that Hex Maniac out and punch him right in the face. Knock out the Tina before it can knock you out. One Giovanni, which again, I say, take out it for the Float Stone. And then one Ranger, because of Glaceon or Jolteon, if you can't get the Mega Steelix out. Then we're running five Basic Steel. The reason why? Tina. And the reason why five? Candy Nax calls for five. So now you can attack with Candy Nax and have just Basic Energies. It'll take a lot longer to set up. I realize that, which is really sad, but it's worth it because you're doing a lot of damage. And then simple because it costs two double colorless to use the attack. We got four doubles. Um, we got for more damage, four strong energies. You can put them all on the same Mega Steelix. I just would not recommend it. And my table just fell. Which scared the god out of me. But anyway, um, four shields. These are great for keeping you from getting hurt. It's super hard, but... I mean, it's super hard to keep these on there because people always want to get them off so they can do more damage. Like, when I was against that Sizor da deck, I kept making sure that they couldn't deal enough damage because I had... Four of these on my Mega Steelix, and they were only doing, um, what, what, or 80 damage, and then that's going to be pretty much mute, because we're just going to hit back with 160 or more, but anyway, you get to see my little poster of Mythical Pokies, and I cannot wait to get the, um, Keldeo. It's not that bad, um, considering that my dad's using um, Evolto Break. 
the Keldeo <laughs> promo full art that's for the new generations thing. It says its ability is justified, which makes it do 50 more damage if you're against a dark type Pokemon. Which Darkrai knockout and then um it's attacks secret sword. It can be reset with Ranger, by the way. It is 100 damage, can't use it again next turn. But again, Ranger deletes that. So, you can just do 150 every turn, which is really good, but 160 is far better. So anyway, I'm going to... Um, Oh, I want to put a video in that gave me the idea for this deck, but I don't have permission from the person who made this deck in the first place that I use. Um, he was, he's TCG Center at YouTube, Mega Steelix deck. It is a great deck, I just see a little bit of flaws with it, like um, having... Steel, because it says Primal Clash and on, yet yeah, it's running Steel Shelter. That's what kind of made me triggered. <laughs> but, I mean, he has the point. He has an idea of what Primal Clash and on seems to be. So, he pretty much understands. And, um, I asked him in that video and one of his more recent videos. I don't remember what it was. But I loved that more recent video. It was great. I wanted to use it, but it brain changed. And if you don't know, I'm really poor and don't have the money for shamans or don't have any shamans right now. I could borrow them from one of my friends, but shut up, amigo. If you don't know, amigo's my bird. And then my cat is on my couch. Trying to sleep, but is too fat to sleep. Let's see if I can get him. Smell out the camera, Cyrus. There's my little kitty. Yeah. And then my mom's cat. Who knows where he is? He's a scaredy cat. He's scared of everything. So, I yeah. am. That's the deck list for Mega Steelix. The canyon axe that kills a lot of things, that, but can't kill Tina. I mean, it's really sad because I'm pretty sure you could add another attacker of some sort, but not sure what kind of attacker. Because Mega Steelix is the only attacker in this deck. That's the problem. If they knock out all three of your Steelixes, and you can't get them back because you've used all of your super rods, and Clowitzers, well, you're kind of screwed. Um, but anyway, that's going to end off this video. Um, also, like and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And if you enjoyed the video. Um, I attempt to make uh, one video per week. But it depends on how much battery my tablet has, which is what I'm recording on now. I'm sorry for the video quality. I'm I don't have that money for a, an HD camera, or I would definitely go ahead and bam right for the HD, and just go ahead and do all of this stuff, but better quality. So, also comment sen section below. Tell me if I should start doing vlogs or do something like that. And, um, also, uh, should I keep going with Minecraft? I'm not good with the things because I used to be some stupid Tweety character, but now since I got a new account, it's saddening because it's my account and I'm not old enough to be able to have my own settings changed. So I have to wait for someone else to help me with it. Because I have no idea how. 
and because my chat restri uh, restrictions say, no, you can't do this. So evil. I hate that. So should I keep going with Minecraft despite not being able to play with friends unless it's battle mode or tumble? So that's going to end off the video for today. Hope you all enjoyed, and remember, like, and subscribe if you're new, and have a great day.